Hi, it's Hannah, and this video will talk you through Wikipedia's homepage. So, if you input Wikipedia into your search engine and click the English Wikipedia, you should get to a page that looks like this. On this page, you see we're on the main page, and there's different sections. So, at the top left hand corner, we have today's featured article. Then, on the right, we have an in the news section. Underneath this, we have an on this day bit. So on this day in 1936, Jesse Owens won the first of his four gold medals at the Berlin Olympics. To the left of this, there's a did you know section. So did you know that after a fisherman crashed into a volcano, it was named after him? If you click the link there, it will take you to the page. Underneath this section, we have a from today's featured list. And then underneath this, there's a today's featured picture. So this is an image of a fishing village in northern Norway. Underneath here we have a, other areas of Wikipedia, so there's a community portal, a help desk, so all of these places will help you if you're stuck when editing Wikipedia. Now underneath this part there's a Wikipedia sister projects. So Wikipedia is hosted by the Wikimedia Foundation, a non-profit organisation that also hosts another other range of projects. So for example there's Commons, which is a free media repository where you can upload images, Wikidata, a free knowledge base, Wikiquote, Wikisource, and lots of other Wikimedia projects. Underneath here, there's Wikipedia languages. So this Wikipedia is written in English, but there's also other Wikipedias available. So you can read it in German, in French, in Bahasa Indonesia, and many other languages. Now, if we scroll back up to the top, you can see next to the main page, there is a talk button. And this talk button is where people can discuss the articles that should appear on the page. So this page is only for discussing the contents of the English Wikipedia's main page. You can see there's a place for errors, a place for general discussion. If we go back to the main page, you can see that on the top right hand corner, there's a talk button. Now this talk page is for your own personal talk page where people can leave you messages. Next to this, there's contributions and this details all the edits you've made on Wikipedia and everything you've done. Next to this, you can create your account and then you can also log in. On the next row down, you can see there's a button called View History, and this button takes you to the history page for an article, and this shows everything that's happened on this article, so all the edits made, you can also thank people for any edits they make, and you can view different versions and different previous versions and compare them. Now, if we go to today's featured article, you can see there's a star, and this star indicates that it's a featured article, and the featured articles are considered to be some of the best on Wikipedia, and it's determined by accuracy, neutrality, completeness, and style, and is chosen by Wikipedia's editors. So if we go back to our featured article, you can see this is for a type of plant, commonly known as a parrot bush, and you can see that underneath the title there's a lead section. And this lead section summarises the key points in the article, and it will say why it's notable and just give you a brief overview. On the right hand side you can see there's an info box. Now this info box gives key information and key elements of the topic. So for the plant you can see we have scientific classification, different names, different varieties and synonyms. If it was for a person, famous person for example, you could have place of birth, date of birth, date of death, any relatives, any awards they've won, that sort of stuff. Now you can see there's a content section and this gives you all the headings and this headings is the main body of the article. You can see we've got description, discovery and naming, more information, we've got lots of images, some which may have been uploaded from Wikimedia Commons, and different subsections, so common names, taxonomy, and then infogeneric placement. So lots of information here. And you can see on the references section at the bottom, we have, I think, about 76 references. So that's quite a lot, and you'd expect for a featured article that they would have lots of citations. There's also an external link section which takes you to other places on the internet which, are, which will give you more information. It also shows you where how it's linked to other Wikipedia sister projects, so there's Wikimedia Commons, Wikisource. There's also, you can see that this queue number here is a link to Wikidata. And there's different categories, so this falls under the categories of trees of Australia, trees of Mediterranean climate, endemic flora of Western Australia. So a really good detailed article. Thanks for watching and I hope this has helped you explore Wikipedia further.